y'all welcome back to the vlog i am actually obviously kicking off a new vlog um it is a brand new day i am up and at it getting ready for the day i have my good old water right here to kick off the day i'm actually gonna get better with um drinking water first thing in the morning it's gonna water right on my sink ready to go um and i am actually in the process of getting myself together so I just brushed my teeth, um, wiped my eyes and all of that. And now I am about to jump into cleansing. Um, I'm about to wash my face and all of that. But I want to share a new product with you guys that I am going to be trying out and kind of starting a new journey with this brand. And that is Dermatica. Now Dermatica is a brand that provides personalized formulas to help target a variety of skin concerns. Personalized formulas straight to your door. It is super easy, super convenient. And all I have to do is just go online and fill out my skin profile. So I went on there, I answered questions about my skin type, my skin concerns, I uploaded pictures of my skin and my face makeup free. So I kind of just, you know, took a couple different angles and all of that and they did all the heavy lifting and all the heavy work and curated a personalized formula just for me. And the best part is that even though this little thing looks small, you guys, it actually is just enough to last you 28 days or a full month. I did love that in their packaging, they provide actually like a step-by-step -step guide of how to make the most out of your routine. And it pretty much walks you through every single step. So first is the cleanse, then you apply the prescription, then you treat. So once you apply the formula, if you have any serum or anything that you want to add on top of that, you can apply that. Then you moisturize and you protect. Today we are going to follow this five step routine which should be pretty easy. And again, I'm excited because you guys know how big, big, big I am on skin. And it just takes two pumps to apply to my entire face. So if you want to start your own skin journey, click link down below in the description box to learn more about Dramatica and use code KyraNox to get your first month for only $4.99 and 10% off your second month. All right, so my teeth brushed, my skin is all prepped. Before I get dressed, I'm gonna go ahead and brush my brows up and just so they look so crazy. I need to get them done ASAP. I am like trying to decide if I'm going to go get my lashes done tomorrow or not. They really don't need to be done right now, but the only thing is that my lash check is going out of town next week so she won't be in next week and i typically go in for a refill next week so i'm trying to decide if i can just hold out or if i should just hold out until she gets back from vacation or if i should just go in now so it still looks good decisions decisions i really have no idea i'll need to go get my nails refilled as well y'all it's just one big struggle but y'all see my hair is like in this bun because I haven't had time to wash and style it. Even though I will say wash and styling my hair with my hair short, y'all, is so much easier. My full-time job has been so insane that I haven't even had a chance to like breathe really. So <laughs> that's why everything's a show at this point. All right, okay, so I, oh, I don't want to do. Okay, so you guys see I am obviously in my bathroom. And I realized that my YouTube fam, since I'm kind of like catching y'all up, cause like y'all know I'm behind over here. Um, but since I'm trying to catch my YouTube fam up on all of the house updates, I wanted to give you guys a little tour, a little mini tour of our bathroom renovation. This is hands down like my, I, okay, obviously the living room is like my ultimate favorite transformation, but like the bathroom is a really, really, really close second because I never thought that I could love a bathroom so much. Like I never thought that I could love a bathroom as much as I love our bathroom. And the best part about it is that what we did to this space, it was only a couple things that we really did to it to like spruce it up. And they were pretty fairly easy projects, which I love. And it wasn't that expensive either. Like because we only did a couple of different things kind of spruce it up. So I'm gonna try to change real quick and walk you guys through the bathroom before I have to go hop into work mode. Guys, welcome to our Our bathroom. Oh, me and Dion are just so happy with how the whole space 
came out. We loved it before we even anything to it because we really, really, really love the layout of our bathroom. But like once our designer came in and like worked her magic, we like really, 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 really loved it. So first of all, in this house, me and Dion do have our own separate vanity. So this is his vanity. That is mine over there, thank God. I feel like ever since the last house, like me and Dion can never share vanities ever again because we just love having her. I personally love having my own separate one from him because let's just say we have two different levels of cleanliness and I don't have to like get on there every day about like putting his toothpaste away and all that. So like it really works out that we have two separate spaces. I don't know if you guys see what we did on each side. We pretty much did the same thing. So we added brass hardware to our um, cabinets. We swapped out uh, the faucet to brass as well. We added these custom mirrors. Our designer sourced these from a local company. She had them made. I really love the size of it and then the black iron framing just does something like this really sets it off. We also went in and added sconces on the sides of the mirrors. And me and Dion knew like, like whenever we, even when we were building, we knew that we wanted to do like sconces on um, the sides of each of the mirrors. And we freaking love it. I did find out pretty much sourced everything. So unfortunately guys, I don't have links to anything. No, I have links to the hardware. I will link that down below. But other than that, everything else she sourced directly from the manufacturer. So um, I do not have links, but again, we love how everything came out and that is pretty much it. So again, we kept it pretty simple. Oh, also if you guys cannot tell right here. So we painted the back of our doors black. So the front part that faces our bedroom, that's still white, but we painted the back of the doors black and also the other two doors in the bathroom are also black. Just like really pop against the um, lighter plastered walls. So yeah, that's what we did. Also again, the plaster, we did plaster all of the walls in our bathroom a really pretty beige color that we are freaking obsessed with we love it and yeah it's just had a nice little mix of like black and beige and brass and we love it and then here is our shower and bathtub nothing really exciting to see here we didn't really change really we didn't change anything in the bathtub the only thing that we changed in our shower is you guys see we have this black marble tile which is chef's kiss. The only thing that we changed over here is that we actually had someone come in and re-grout our floors or all the tile. And the reason why is because for some reason our builder, they the darkest color that they had that could be used in the bathroom was like a dark gray. We just knew that it would look much better if we did black grout. And we were not wrong because our grout looks freaking phenomenal. We, I mean like that grout, the tile overall looks phenomenal with the black grout and we really love it. Okay, and last but not least, we have my side of the bathroom again, which I freaking love. So we have my vanity and then we have my little makeup area. I absolutely love it. I love the amount of space that I have. I love all the storage. So I have like drawers on drawers on drawers on drawers. So over here we did like this really funky like weird chick mirror. Again my designer source but I have no idea where she got it from. Um, but she found this like really cool like funky shaped mirror. Then we did these two sconces on the side but I like that it has more of like a like a glam room like vanity effect with the the bulb lights and then also I like that these lights here are dimmable. So like this is on its full brightness I can even dim them down depending on like how much light I need. We have this chair here. Again, I have no idea where she got this from, but this is like a really cool boucle chair. So comfortable. Yeah, that is my makeup vanity and I actually love it. Like I genuinely never thought that I would spend this much time in a bathroom, but when I say y'all, I'm in here so much. I've never spent, the amount, the amount of time that I have spent in this bathroom, I have never, ever, ever spent. In another bathroom before. Later on in the day, I am headed to pick up Olivia. Uh, I'm heading out. I'm heading to get her later than I like. Um, but it is what it is. She won't be the last one at school, so that's all that matters. I'm like, I'm always like, I don't know why I have this thing where I'm like, I do not want baby to be the last one <laughs> at school ever. So like, I always try. I typically try to get her around 5:30. Today they'll be more like six. But again, at least she won't be the last one there. So that makes me feel better and honestly no lie y'all whenever i go pick olivia up olivia did not ready to leave <laughs> okay like whenever, I go, like whenever i go pick her up we stand in like the front um the front area for at least at least 10 minutes 
because this girl do not be wanting to leave. She just loves the staff at her school, but especially the director, Olivia, like, <laughs> freaking adores her and I love her too love like how she is with the kids I love how she is with Olivia like she like she loves on her and I just love that and, was, and so never go pick her up like she's she's almost always in the front like with the director and <laughs> Olivia did not be one ready to go so that's funny so I, that makes me that I will say that does make me feel better on days where I'm running late because I know she's just not there like miserable how was your day mama was it good you said it was good it was good well yeah you say hi, people. I oh, can't really see you. Let's see. Did you have a good day, Pumpkin? Yeah. Uh, what's, that's not my name. Mommy. Yes, Pumpkin. Y'all, she's like learned at school. She just be like here, 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 here. Yeah. I don't. Mommy, mommy doesn't want any though. But I'll take it. Thank you for sharing. It's okay. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for sharing, Mama. What do you say? You're welcome. Yeah. Welcome. There you go. Say, say we got our after school snacks. Mm. Say cheers. Ding. Yummy. Yummy. I, so I, I pull up to Olivia's I, school. I, no, here. No, uh, mommy. Y'all, Olivia is obsessed with my glasses. So obsessed. First of all, y'all can you hear her. She's like eyes, eyes. So when she says I, she's about her sunglasses, my sunglasses, or just glasses in general. Libby just loves glasses. And so she calls, because she can't say sunglasses or glasses yet, she says ice, ice, and points to her eyes. So I didn't know she's talking about, talking about sunglasses or glasses. Here, Munchie, you want to have these? These are old ones. Oh, cool. She doesn't see her face. She's lit up like a Christmas tree. Oh, oh. Anyways, y'all, remember how I said that Olivia literally, like, when I go pick her up, she doesn't want to leave? Well, today was another example of it. So I pull up to her school, and I'm walking in, and I just hear a bunch of screaming. Like, literally a bunch of screaming, and I'm like, I bet you it's Olivia. Like, I just knew it was her. So I walk in, and it was Olivia and, like, two little kids from her class. They're literally at the front, just, like, running back and forth across, like, the front entryway. They're just, like, running back and forth. And, like, eating it up, having the time of their lives. They're just like, ah! Like the three of them are just like going back and forth like literally having the time of their lives and so one of the other moms one of the, the mom of the, the one of the little girls that she was running with um like we got there at the same time so we walk in and we're just like sitting there like watching them run back and forth and we're like you done yet are you, you ready to go olivia's like no and then she takes off again and she's like ah, ah. so she, anyways i had to like literally pick her up and grab her to walk her out the door because <laughs> oh you huh what mama call what Oh, okay, so two things about Olivia. First, eyes, if she does this, that means glasses or sunglasses, okay? And then she says, car, car, basically that means I'm taking too long and she wants me to drive, because, but she can't, she doesn't really correlate that driving is the action and car is the noun. So she's just like, car, car, and then she goes like this to like signify that she wants me to go ahead and drive because she's like sitting in the car like stalled for too long huh mama oh hey cool girl. <laughs> hey ready to go home no no you don't want to go home no you you look so cool look at you all right let me go ahead and drive before this one throws a fit <laughs> don't look at me smile like that all right, Mommy, you drive? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Here we go. All right, pumpkin. What do you want to do for dinner? Oh, you said apple. Okay, you want to do apple and pasta? Here, look. You want to do apple and pasta? No, that one you're not going to eat. Let's do this one. Here, let's just do this one. Mama can add a, a different sauce to it, okay? Okay. All right, and then we'll get your apple, okay? All right, we'll get your apple juice. 
let's do the apple juice, pasta, and apples. Okay? Okay. All right, and then we'll do some broccoli. Broccoli! Mommy needs some wine. Mommy needs a little wine for the night. What? Why did you do that? No, don't oh, close the door. open that pumpkin by the way y'all for all my moms out there who are always so what's the matter oh he, oh yeah yeah yeah. i'm sorry i got your apple that's right i'm sorry let me get your apple in a second okay um for all the moms out there who's always looking for like easy <laughs> oh juice yes let me get your juice in a second okay um for all the moms out there who are always looking for like easy like little hacks and just things that make your life more convenient okay yes yes oh my gosh yes Olivia. <laughs> um, anyone out there who is, look, you know, I'm telling you, when she sees something, she gotta have it. Look, out there who's looking for, like, for things that make your life easier, check out Little Spoon. It is a subscription service for kids. They even do baby food. Actually, I think they do like baby food, smoothies, and like the toddler meals. I have been ordering mm. from them for like at least three months now. Like. Probably longer than that. I may have started like back in May. <laughs> all I hear, y'all talking to y'all, all I hear is. <sighs> oh my goodness. Also, I'm gonna ignore my baby's hair. I, I really should one of these days do like uh, before and after school edition, like for like a week straight so I can show you guys how Olivia looks when I send her off to school, and then how she looks when she comes home from school, huh? <laughs> Y'all, she come home from school, like look, she be having stuff all over her clothes, her shoes be dirty, covered in food, or like paint or whatever it is they're coloring with that day. Her hair be a mess. You gotta eat this whole juice box before you even get to dinner. You know that, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know that, right? Yeah. yeah. Say, I had a great day at school. Let's go. Say, I love mommy. I love mommy. Say, I love mommy. I love mommy. Say, I'm mommy's baby. I'm that baby. Baby. Say, I'm the best. Baby. Say, I'm the smartest. I'm not mommy. Say, I'm the cutest. I'm the cutest. <laughs> Let's get your food, okay? Apple. All right, come on. Let me get your apple with dinner. Let's wash your hands first, okay? Okay. Open. Come on, pumpkin. Let's go play the bop it. Yeah. Say yeah. Mommy. Yeah, pumpkin. <laughs> huh, pumpkin? <laughs> Whoop. There you go. Hey, girl. Hey, not, not you trying to repeat me. It's my hey, girl. Say hey, girl. Let's go. Hey, girl. <laughs> Oh, did you poop poop? You did. Perfect timing. Oh, say you poop poop. <laughs> up, up, okay. I got the light on. No, let's go, to, let's go to the room. Go to the room first. We'll come back out to the ball in a second. Go to the room, please. Gotta change your stinky diaper. Come on, let's go, mama. We'll be back. It's not going anywhere. So funny because Whenever Olivia poops, she like has to be super focused. She will literally go stand in a corner. Or if you say, Olivia, you're okay? She's like, no, no, no. But like, we know that means that she's in the her, her moment. And then she like look away and like keep focusing on what she's doing, which is pooping. So she's always like, no, no, no. Like, no mommy, no mommy. And so she like, will just stand, she literally just stand in the corner by herself. And it's like focused like this. It's so funny. <laughs> Are you having fun? Yeah. Say yeah! Yeah. Oh my gosh, y'all. So <laughs> many Olivia updates to give y'all. Seriously, like so many updates to give y'all. Obviously, y'all see she is in a... <laughs> full-on bed now. We are out of the crib. Um, why? First of all, she transitioned to a bed a lot earlier than I would have liked her to. 
I personally would have waited a little bit longer for her to stay in her. I like ideally, I feel like about now is when I would just leave it alone. I just put a new nanit camera in her room, so she just like is obsessed with it. But ideally, like I would just now be transitioning her into a bed because it's closer to her birthday. But no, this little rascal right here figured out how to climb out of her bed. So she's now in a bed. She loves sitting in and out of her bed, which is a good thing and a bad thing. It's a bad thing for us because sometimes in the middle of the night, she would just get out of the bed just to get out of the bed. <laughs> so that's not fun. Okay, you stink. Let's go. So, oh, come on. You go, oh, come on. You stinky. Oh, come on, Olivia. Yeah, no, we don't need a pajamas right now, okay? Yeah, we don't need the PJs right now. Hold on, I'll put these over here. Yeah. Here, come on over here. Ah, leave them alone. Put it back. Thank you, girl. She, I'm telling you, all the girls always, <laughs> always into something. Come on, stinky girl. 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 Say it's time to change your diaper. It's time to change your diaper. Hey, 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 hey. Ho, 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 ho. <laughs> oh, stinky. Mwah. Sleep in another one. See, got lots of boogies. Look, look at this one. Yeah, yucky. <laughs> Oh, that's yours now? Thank you so much. I'm sitting down here, okay? <laughs> Anyways, y'all, clearly we are upstairs having a little playtime before bed, waiting on Dada to get home. So while we are watching her play, I thought that I would do a little bit of a little Olivia clothing haul. I went to a couple stores the past few days to get some fall clothes for her. So I went to my favorite places to get her clothes, which is pretty much TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I needed real fall clothes. So this is outfit number one. It's like a cute little top and dress situation here's outfit two this is more of like winter outfit but you can never start too early this is outfit two it's like a really cozy knit sweater some black leggings this is very fall and festive i love it this is outfit number three like another top it's like a little rust colored corduroy dress a matching headband so oh i'm sorry mama so cute my girl loves who is this Mini. My girl loves just a mini. So at this point, anytime I see anything mini mouse with mini mouse on it, I will get it for Olivia. So this is like a cute like little jogger set. Has like the jogger pants. 
and the top this is like a perfect airport outfit or travel day outfit this is so cute another little sweater and legging set then i got her this other little set it's like a short sleeve shirt and long overalls i got her this other cute little nike y'all isn't this so cute it's like a little nike set uh oh this little nike set the matching jacket the matching pants so cute and then got her another little mini outfit and this one here's from walmart wasn't it yep it was from walmart no. Remember, we said we're gonna finish all the eggs. So let's put all the eggs up first. Okay, so let's put that one back in here. Okay, you're getting sidetracked. All right, do which, which one of those? Okay, put that, no, put it together, Olivia. Look at me. Put it together. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, now put it down. Put it together. There you go. Now, what's these two? Down there, put those together, please. Thank you. Okay, where's the other one? Oh, yeah. There you go. Put it together. Now put it in the box. Okay, now the green one. So Dion just got home. As soon as he got home, kind of swapped. So he is like upstairs in Olivia's bath. And then I like darted down here because he bought home some food and I'm starving and I cannot wait to chow down. He went to one of our favorite go-to spots here in Houston. It's called Mike Seafood. If you have not had Mike Seafood, you should. You are missing out. It is so good. Y'all, they have this crawfish fried rice that literally is to die for. So typically whenever we go, we get the salmon and crawfish fried rice meal. It is so good. Like, look at it. Look at this yumminess. Ugh. To be honest, I am about to eat real quick and go run in the shower, put on my head scarf, put on some pajamas, and call it a night. Like, I am beyond exhausted so with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and end off the video right here i hope you all enjoyed today's vlog um if you guys did give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click the link down below in the description box to learn more about grammatica and don't forget to use the code kyranox to get your first month for 4.99 and 10 percent off your second month so hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will catch you guys in the next one bye y'all